We begin tonight with a crunch on your wallet. Gas prices are on the rise again. And now many drivers around northeastern and central Pennsylvania find themselves paying $4 or more per gallon. So why the hike even after the peak summer travel season? For that answer, we go live to Newswatch 16 Sarah Binoski. She joins us from Music. Sarah. Well, Scott Trish, that is definitely the question and no big surprise. People we spoke with are very upset. Some say they can't remember ever paying this much for a gallon of gas. They hope the price drops soon, but they say they don't think it will. Gas prices all over are higher than they have been in quite a while. Almost four bucks a gallon in our area and across the Northeast. Four dollars is terrible. They can't go nowhere. We can't get nowhere, you know. Well, if I'm spending that kind of money in gas, I'm not going to go out, you know, be buying pizza or, or doing, you know, going other stuff. So, and you wonder why the economy is the way it is. Control the gas prices, the economy will go up. Now, according to analysts, the price of gas is so high because as Hurricane Isaac approached, it disrupted oil refineries in the Gulf Coast. Some people we spoke with say they just don't believe that. I think it's got to be. Just, they just want to jack the prices up. I don't think it's anything to do with the Gulf and the oil refineries. It's just a shame you can't even do the necessary things because that's a lot out of your pocket to fill your car anymore. I think the gas could come down cheaper. Uh, if they really want to do something about it, they can. But uh, you know the way it is. Uh, they're going to get you for whatever they can get you for. Now, analysts say there should be relief soon. It could come as early as next week, and they say the Northeast tends to be the most affected by gas prices, whether they go up or down, because this region tends to import more gasoline than the rest of the nation. Sarah Bonowski, Newswatch 16, reporting live tonight in Muzik. Thank you, Sarah.